Hey, maybe next year's special will be better. The holiday season was in full swing on the island of Sodor. All across the island, stations were being decorated with trees and lights. All the engines were in good spirits, even Diesel. Good morning, Henry. Have a great day. But there was one engine who loved Christmas more than anyone else. It's beginning to look a lot like Christmas. Everywhere you go, take a look in the shunting yards. Shunting I appreciate the holiday spirit, Ryan, but must you express it so early in the morning? Oh, sorry, Daisy. It's just I love the Christmas season so much. See you around later. He said it might not get here till after Christmas. Well, that's not good. What's the point of having decorations after Christmas? What about the Christmas party, sir? It's always the highlight who sing carols around the tree. Dear, oh dear. Ah, we might have to cancel the party this year. What? What's the rush? Is it true what they've been saying, Cranky? Is what true? That the ship with the decorations for Natford. Is it really delayed? Oh, that. Yeah, unfortunately, the ship was a day late leaving the docks. A whole day? What could have caused that? Search me. All I know is that it probably won't be here until after Christmas. But... The Christmas party! Oh, all oh, the children will be so sad. There must be something we can do. Unless you can figure out a way to attach a rope to a ship that's far out to sea and pull it in. That's possible? Oh, uh, no, Ryan. I was kidding. We might not have decorations, but we can still have a tree. Sorry, Ryan. I just picked up the last tree from Monster Castle. So we have no tree and no Christmas decorations. We have to do something. And if it helps, Terence knows where the best trees on the island are. Maybe he can help you. <gasps> That's brilliant. Oh, you're a genius, Thomas. I must find him right away. Uh, bye. Oh, hi, Ryan. How are you? Sorry, Philip. Can't talk. Must find a tree. Oh, okay. It needs to be big. Oh, and poofy. Oh, was poofy the right word? Oh, whatever. It needs to be perfect. Oh, but none of these are perfect. Not another red signal! Hey, hello Ryan dearie. Oh, hello Mrs Kindly. I hope you're having a wonderful Christmas. And I hope you are as well. Although you seem a little bit put off. Is something wrong? 
Oh, I was told that there's no Christmas tree for the Knapford party tonight. I'm trying to find one. Well, as nice as trees are, it's spending time with friends and family that make up Christmas, Ryan. Not trees or presents. I guess you're right. Oh, I'm sorry. I have to go now. Have a wonderful Christmas! I'm glad I've caught you. Oh, hello, Ryan. What's up? Thomas told me you're the best Christmas tree finder. Uh, uh, where can I find one for the Christmas party tonight at Knapford? Uh, well, Thomas took the last big tree I had. It was the last perfect tree around this part of the island. Um, other than going to Misty Island, I'm afraid I'm not sure. Uh, oh. Actually, there might be one other place. Really? Where? There's a stretch on the main line near Crosby that has a lot of trees along it. You might have one that's to your liking. I'll have a look. Thank you, Terence. Merry Christmas! Hey, watch out, though. It can get icy along that line. Find the perfect tree! Oh, that's brilliant! I'm coming, tree! Oh yeah, here I come! Whoa! 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 seen Ryan? He hasn't picked up his coal delivery from the yard yet. Uh, no sir. I haven't seen him since this morning when he was collecting ballast. Ryan? I saw him leaving Brenham Docks. He said something about finding a tree. Finding a tree? Oh dear, he could be anywhere. Uh, excuse me sir. There's bad news I'm afraid. Oh, when is there not? What is it now? I've gotten the latest weather report. There's a strong snowstorm coming tonight. Oh dear. We have to find Ryan before the storm hits. Oliver, I need you to deliver Ryan's coal trucks. I'm going to call the rescue center. We have no time to lose. Ryan's gone missing, Harold. You're up. Aye aye, Rocky. Up, up, and away! Terence! Oh, hello, Harold! Ryan is missing! You haven't happened to see him, have you? I did earlier this afternoon. He was looking for the Christmas tree. Do you know where he might have gone? Try checking around Crosby. Right ho, thank you, chap. No, no, no one knows where I am. Oh, I'll be stuck out here all Christmas. I found him! He's over here! Mm -hmm. 
Oh, here he is. Hello, Ryan. You feeling the chill? I overheard what you said about the ship with the decorations being delayed. I didn't want to see the party cancelled, so I wanted to find a tree for, for Natford, sir. Oh, Ryan, you should have told someone what you were doing. Yes, sir. I'm sorry, sir. Right. Well, let's get you back on the line. Later, Ryan was back on the line. Edward gave him some fresh coal, and he soon had a warm boiler again. Was that the tree you were looking at, Ryan? Uh, oh, uh, yes, sir. Ah, it's perfect! Well done, Ryan! We'll get that to Natford at once. I believe we still have a few lights from last year. The party will go on! The workmen had cut down the tree and placed it on Ryan's flatbed, and together, everyone headed for Natford. That day, Ryan learned the true meaning of Christmas. It wasn't the tree or the fancy decorations, it was spending time with his friends on the magical island of Sodor. Merry Christmas, everyone!